Uh, hello, my name is Matthew, and a few months ago I read The Damned by Hausman, Hoosman, however you say that, and I've read it a few times. I love it. I'm a, a big fan of Hausman, Against Nature, a few of his other books, uh, and this is the first book in a series which follows this character, Dirtle, and it's his uh, spiritual transformation. And Mirroring, mirroring um, Dante's Divine Comedy. We start in hell, and we're going to, uh, through these books, um, ascend. And this is a book that, on the one hand, is rather, rather um, boring, dull, plotless. It's a few few characters that are scholarly and nebbish. They have intellectual conversations. We spend a lot of time with Dirtle. He's a, he's a writer and he's uh, writing a book. Many of the chapters are literally just the excerpts from the book that he's uh, writing. And then these kind of late hour uh, dinner parties and conversations that he has with the other friends that are interested in the occult. On the other hand, this is a book full of savagery and depravity and debauchery and madness and violence. The, the, the story that he's trying to write is a biography of a medieval child murderer and Satanist. And so this book is full of black magic and devil worship and um, grotesque, gruesome acts of torture, child murder, and um, may mayhem and madness. It, 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 it goes into great detail, um, the idea and the participation and behavior of Satanists and people that uh, go to black masses and um, live this um, satanic lifestyle. And you can read the book, it has all those things, <clears throat> but there are these little side plots which I would rather talk about. So, um, Two, two parts. Uh, Dirtle has a servant. He lives in an apartment building, and the apartment has a servant that will go around and clean the rooms. And I love these uh, 20th century uh, <laughs> uh, servants in novels. I Every time there's a servant in a novel, I'm always uh, just so pleased. And... <clears throat> In this one, the, the servant is um, incompetent, uh, unreliable, lazy, and so, uh, and on and on and on. And so Dirtle um, should think to himself that there's a schedule when the servant shows up to clean the apartment. But he's never on time. And so Dirtle doesn't know uh, when this guy is just going to show up to his... Um, to his apartment and the the servant when he does show up he does a terrible job and it's like comically described that every time the servant is finished the apartment is dirtier than it was when he left so that's one part the other part is through this novel uh, Dirtle meets a woman that he becomes infatuated with and also, this, this novel is full of um, chauvinism. You can't get around that. But it, it is a, it's an aspect of the, the, the characters. Uh, Dirtle, uh, an aspect of Dirtle's character. But this woman, uh, her name was uh, Shantae Louvre, Shantae Louvre, I believe. 
and she might be an incubus, she might be a succubus, she might, might be none of those things. The book goes into great detail, the differences and specifics of what exactly is a succubus and what exactly is an incubus. But, Dirtle has a date. And, again, anytime I'm reading a book and there's a character uh, preparing for a date, uh, prior to the date, being very fussy and hurried and very busy and uh, trying to get everything in the apartment just right, uh, I, I just found so funny. And we have these, these two details that come together where now Dirtle has to run around not just cleaning the apartment, but um, going behind the servant who did a terrible job cleaning the apartment. And one of the details that I loved was that um, Dirtle realizes that the servant had washed the windows. And the reason that he knows that the servant washed the windows is because there's fingerprints all over, all over the window, window pane, uh, which I just found hilarious. Um, and so th th this book is um, dark and grotesque and violent and um, on and on and on. But th th those are two aspects, little moments, side stories within, within the novel. Um, that I just found so entertaining, and I just thought I would uh, share that. Um, all the rest of it is obvious, I suppose, uh, even by just judging the cover. So um, those are some of my thoughts on The Damned by Hausman. I love it. Uh, a very funny book. <laughs> so uh, leave a comment if you would like. Thank you for watching, and take care.